Hi, it's Stuart here. Caden Head here once again with Parrots TV. I have with me Parrots man of the match, Chris Turley. Chris, your thoughts on tonight's game? Rubbish. Very simple. Rubbish. No up to it. No up to the mark. Embarrassing. Yeah. I think first period it wasn't too bad and then it just went downhill for there. Aye. Basically, yeah. There's no, there's no much to be saying about it. Just we won it there and that's it. Well, congratulations on your unfortunately only goal tonight for the team. Won't keep you any longer, mate. Yeah, boy. Cheers. Sure, he wants to give me Pirates TV. I have with me Pirates coach Ian Tilly. Ian, your thoughts on today's game? I think the score, you know, says says everything. Uh, credit to, to Aberdeen. Um, they came here and executed well. Um, I thought that, you know, first period um, we, we lost two goals. Kind of some just some bounces. You, you you take that. The game's much of a muchness. But then um, second period, you know, there was a couple of penalties. Whether they were good or bad penalties, you know, it was you can decide that. Um, but you know we didn't execute, and, and, and Aberdeen did. So that, that second period, you know, ultimately killed the game. But you know it's just it's, it's bad. You know when we've got our goalie wins us the game. You know two games in a row, and then we just leave him out to dry there like that. It's just it's absolutely ridiculous. Like everybody in this building deserves their money back. That's just ridiculous. That that is. You know, let's be let's be black and white about it. You know that is not good enough. That's not good enough. You know. Winning um, and losing, you know, sometimes you win and you don't play that well and you get by, that's fine. You know, sometimes you lose and you play well and you maybe don't deserve to lose, but not at the scoreline, um, playing at home, that that is, you know, it, as I say, again, credit to Aberdeen, but everybody in the building, you know, definitely deserves the money back. Okay, and I won't keep you any longer, I think you've just about said it all. Thanks.